Hi everyone, my name is Erkin Yücel and I'm an R&D engineer at Global Dynamic Systems and this is the second part of boiler and steam operations. Here, as the second part of the boiler operation video, I have filled up the boiler with fresh water and now I will start building up pressure. I'm going to close the vent valve and line up fuel oil system for the burner. I'm going to start the burner with diesel oil. Lining up fuel pumps here. And I will start fuel circulating pump number one. As you can see, the boiler level level is about 87% and feed pumps are in auto position. Freshwater pay makeup pump is running. And from the previous video, I have lined up the freshwater low temperature freshwater cooling system. And in this video, I will line up the high temperature freshwater system. And as you can see, the main engine temperature is about 22 degrees. I will perform preheating operation with steam and heat the main engine up to 60 65 degrees. First, I will start the burner in manual mode. I click the start button. I have to reset the burner trips first so that the burner can start the air intake the igniter is on and the flame is on the main engine is off right now so I'm not able to use the main engine exhaust gas to build up pressure in the combined boiler I will only use its own burner to build up pressure at first. I'm going to speed up this procedure. Normally the boiler is heated up until some level and waited for the thermal balance. I will perform these operations too but in a faster way. I'm changing the simulator speed so that temperature rise is faster as you can see here 23 degrees and once again I will show you the high temperature freshwater cooling system here Freshwater expansion tank is about 74% and the boiler temperature is rising up the water temperature. From the previous video I have lined up the compressed air system with main air compressors and two diesel generators are feeding 440 volt bus bar right now emergency generator is in auto mode and circuit breakers for all the engine room systems are engaged I'll go back to the boiler and observe the temperature rise water has started to evaporate and build up 0.1 bar of pressure here. Here's the temperature and pressure gauges on the control and monitor panel. And there's also gauges on the boiler too.
expansion tank level is 85 percent which is enough I will close the inlet valve of the freshwater expansion tank I will pause the video here and I'll be back with the steam pressure on hello again I've built up steam pressure in the boiler and I switched the burner in auto mode it will continue to run until the steam pressure reaches to 6.7 percent 7 bar and I will switch to lining up freshwater cooling system for main engine I'm opening the inlet valves of the high temperature freshwater pumps and the preheater bypass valve main engine inlet and outlet this is the complete high temperature freshwater system but instead I will switch the freshwater flow to main engine preheater I will close the bypass valve and start preheating pump and start uh, fresh water circulating it p goes into the preheater goes into the main engine and high temperature fresh water controller is in manual mode it is now circulating some of the low temperature and high temperature fresh water and mixing in this valve I will switch this valve position to zero meaning how meaning that high temperature fresh water will be circulated in the circle and I will be able to heat up the main engine faster I now switching back to combined boiler I will open the steam valve and these are the valves for each steam consumers for example separators tanks and other systems in the engine room by opening these valves now I'm able to supply steam pressure to main engine preheater I will open the outlet valve of the main engine preheater and the preheater temperature controller is now in manual mode and so I will be able to open the valve manually I'm now opening 20% on the steam line I will adjust the steam flow rate to about 180 kilograms per hour and the temperature rise before preheater and uh, after preheater is about one degree so this should heat up the main engine in about 10 to 15 minutes to around 60 degrees Celsius I will open the valve a little bit more it's about 60 percent steam is now condensing all the way with this flow rate
I have heated up the main engine in that temperature up to 50 Celsius. Uh, I can continue to heating up main engine heating up further, but I will finish this video here and I'll see you in the next boiler operation video. Have a good day.